the day that I met you, I knew that you were the man for Kristen, without a doubt. We all know what a privilege it is to be witness to a great love story. Kristen, Alex used to tell us all the time, and when I mean all the time, I mean all the time, that all he wanted to do was find someone like you. Kristen are both Irish Catholic, so we have a lot of cousins. Um, Grandma, you might have to correct me, but I think we have like 27,000 cousins. And so, <laughs> when I try to say like, you know, my cousin's getting married, my friends, my coworkers, the checkout lady at Trader Joe's are like, cool. <laughs> um, and so I'm like, no, but really, my cousin is getting married. She is fierce and regal and completely self-actualized, she's perfect. I mean, she's crazy, but she is perfect. <laughs> and I love her so much. As cliche as it sounds, you are without a doubt my better half. You challenge me and help make me a better person, a more generous and patient version of myself. I'm constantly in awe of the dedication and drive that you have to be successful in every aspect of your life. And I absolutely adore the way that you are with my family. If there's one thing that this blasted pandemic has taught me, it is that there is no one that I'd rather be quarantined with months on end than you. As Patrick said to David, you're simply the best, better than all the rest, better than anyone, anyone I ever met, and I'm stuck on your heart. Kristen, as Travis said, I always wanted to be with someone exactly like you. Incredibly kind, enormously smart, creative, patient, beautiful, to your very core. You encourage me to be the best version of myself even when life's circumstances make that very hard. You insist I see the best in all people and situations, and you give me the space to be myself. You change the smoke alarm batteries because I don't like the loud noise it produces. You don't judge me when I sob to a poignant moth radio hour story. I love that you are a sophisticated woman who loves musicals and books, listening to Pod Save America. But I also love that you're not too good for a cheesy cable Christmas movie or some Arby's mozzarella sticks at midnight. Everyone here is so excited 
not just for today, but for what the future will bring for you too.